Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to show you how to do alerts and PayPal on your OBS. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to open up your web browser and you're going to want to go to streamlab or streamelements.com. Register for an account if you haven't already. I already have an account. Up top here you should be able to register. Once you have an account set up in your stream elements, you want to go to over alerts and overlays. Get started. Come down to alerts. Click the little arrow here. These are different alerts. Find one that you want. Let's say you want this one right here. Click on it and then customize. All right. So in here you can choose your subscribe. You can change around different settings and whatnot. You don't have to. Um, when you're done, just click save, publish, and then copy URL. Now what you want to do is go back to stream elements. See. Go back out here. You'll be at your dashboard. If you're at your dashboard, the other way you can do it is when you come in your dashboard, go to overlay gallery, click alerts, find one you want, click create. Make sure it says create a new overlay, not add to existing. Click continue. Give it a name. I'm gonna leave it as Spitfire Animate Alerts. Create my overlay, and then you copy this link right here. Once you have your overlay, you're going to want to go into OBS Studio, which I already have opened up. I'll bring it down to this window here. Hold on. You want to go to OBS Studio. You want to go to Add, Browser Source. Where is it? Yeah, browser, give it a name. We're going to call it alerts with an S so I know to get rid of it because I already have an alert. I already have that. We're going to put alerts set up. Inside browser source, this is where you're going to want to paste that link at and click OK. All right, you can close out your OBS for now. Now, if we go into this, if we click edit, you can actually emulate and then you can do something like subscriber, gift. And there, I heard that actually in the background. That right there was if I take this and I split screen that with my OBS Studio, and we were to do this again, follower event, you can see over here that it's showing up. So that is working. All right, so we're gonna close out of that for now. Now I'm gonna show you how to set up PayPal. So once you have your alert set up, you wanna to go to your PayPal. So you're gonna to go to, is it other? I don't think it's, no, it's revenue, I'm sorry. You go to revenue and then tipping settings. Here in tipping settings, this is where you can link your PayPal account. So what you'll do is you'll type in your PayPal account here and then you'll click connect. And this will set up your PayPal. And you can set up your page settings you want here, your tip amounts. I made them $1, 5 10 15 and $20 amounts. I have tipping sets enabled, design. You can lay out your setup for your page itself. Um, but once you're connected, then you'll have that set up. And you'll be able to accept PayPal. So it's a little quick tutorial. I hope that that helps you guys out. All right. Have a great day.